So this is what keeps me strapped to the treadmill when I run, and uh, these chains connect to a bungee system, and uh, and that keeps me on the treadmill, and it gives me the the weight bearing that I need on my my legs to stimulate those muscles and to make sure that we don't lose too much muscle mass and that we don't lose too much bone density. It's not very comfortable to run in. It's like running with a clumsy rucksack on. It tugs and pulls in different uh, directions, and it, it causes chafing around the hips and around the shoulders. Uh, I've got I've kind of worn it in now, and I, I've got used to it, and I've got it into a position where I'm happy to run the marathon on. Sunday, but that's been quite tough to get used to. I think there's a number of things that are going to keep me motivated and one of the main memories I have of 1999 when I ran the London Marathon before was the atmosphere and the crowd and the other competitors taking part and that that spirit really lifted me the entire way through the race. So in order to try and get some of that up here on board the space station I've got a couple of things. Firstly I've got the uh, Run Social app so I'll actually be looking at the, the route that I'm running and I'll be running alongside everybody else who's running the digital version of the, the London and marathon uh, and also hopefully I'll get the telly uh, sent up to the space station as well so uh, at, at times I'll be able to actually see what's going on uh, with the real race down in London which will be a huge boost to me to be able to know that uh, I'm running alongside everyone down there. In terms of recovery from a uh, race or from running training actually weightlessness I think is one of the perfect environments because the moment you stop running and the moment you get off that bungee system your muscles are in a completely relaxed state and I do think that we recover faster up here from any kind of aches or sprains, any muscular problems, uh, I think do recover quite quickly up here.